let's do that. Kapala High School is Tommy Cox. It was named Hawaii's top principal. Cox right here won the Masayuki Tokioka Excellence in School Leadership Award. That award comes with $25,000 from Island Insurance. Island Insurance Foundation Chairman Tyler Tokioka joins us along with Tommy. Congratulations, Tommy. Uh, and I know you have some plans for that money. We're going to get to that in a second. But, but we saw your face when you were walking off the stage when they announced that you had won the award. Tyler gave us the news. What, what were you feeling at that moment? Uh, definitely surprised, um, you know, being among 14 other definitely deserving principals. Um, I, was, I was more than surprised. Yeah, and that's well said, Tyler, because, I mean, every one of those principals was exceptional, and you know that. Um, why specifically Tommy? What stood out? Well, the thing that stood out for the judges was that Tommy has the early education program. He has other things that he's innovated and adjusted to make it better so that they're getting the full student when they graduate, they're ready to either go on to college, community college, ju JUCO, or just go straight into the workforce. They're all prepped and ready to go. Yeah, what Tyler's speaking of, they, he expanded the early education. They can take college courses. I think there were a couple of students that actually had their degrees when they graduated from high school already, which is incredible. Uh, you were also very uh, prioritized um, making sure that, that teachers can communicate with you and feel like they, that you can advocate for them. Um, why is that important, that open communication with your I teachers? Think, you know, this definitely validates the work that our, that our staff does in the school community. And I'm there to support our teachers and help make their job easier. And um, they're, they're just great. Um, I wouldn't have it any other way than to be working with the staff that I have right now. Yeah. Okay, so you didn't have plans for that money. What are you, what are you doing? Um, so that money is going to go towards our building construction, our CTE uh, class that they're going to invest in a 20-foot tiny home. Uh, out of a container, full of PV, fully furnished, uh, sustainable. So hopefully we can get started on that project soon. So this, this is for teachers that can live on campus? Well, hopefully, one yeah. day down the road. Which, which is actually really great, because this is, this is something solving, I, I would imagine, an issue for you, but, but all across the state. You know, I, I, and I know teachers come out of pocket all the time, right? Whether it's in the classroom or big projects like this. How important is it to, to see this? or? If, if you're a teacher, apply for a grant, figure something out, because it takes the generosity of someone like Island Insurance to, to really get some of these things done. Yes, definitely. Business partners like Island Insurance are always a huge help to us, um, and we truly appreciate their work and their investment in our schools. Yeah, Tyler, just how proud are you of, of the educators that you saw last night? Oh, immensely proud. I mean, that's probably one of the reasons why we created the program, was we wanted to showcase and emphasize how good the principals are in all of these schools, and hopefully they can be shining examples to other principals within the system of the DOE, as far as what can they do, who can they try to mirror, who can they mimic, to try to raise their schools up to the same levels of the, of the 15 that were there today, yeah. yesterday. Yeah, and that was definitely on display last night. Uh, our public schools are in great hands. Tommy, congratulations, we thank appreciate you. it, and thank you, Tyler. Yeah. yeah. All right, it's uh, 7.16 right now, we'll be right back after this.